Hello learners, this is your English teacher Asok Rizal. How are you keeping today? Today we are going to talk on the topic determiner. We are going to uh, talk about the use of some and any. Some, any. The determiner some and any have slightly different meanings. The use of the word some generally implies a belief in the existence of the object or objects under consideration. Whereas the use of the word any may imply a doubt about the existence of the object or objects under consideration. The word some, somebody, someone, something and somewhere are used in affirmative statements as well as in polite question and questions expecting an affirmative reply. Let's see the example. Affirmative statement. I saw some birds in the park. Polite questions. Would you like some tea? Affirmative reply expected. You seem worried. particular object. Example question. Did you see any buds in the park? Negative statements. I don't do. I do not know anyone here, right? I do not know anyone here. Indefinite reference. Any drug store can supply you with aspirin. The word some, somebody, someone, something and somewhere usually cannot be used in a negative statement. If it is desired to change a clause beginning with the word some so that it expresses a negative meaning, some may be changed to no or none depending on whether an adjective or pronoun is required. In the following example, some is used as an adjective modifying the noun books. In order to change the sentence to express a negative meaning, some is replaced by the adjective no. Affirmative meaning, some books were left on the shelf. Negative meaning, no books were left on the shelf. In the following example, some is used as a pronoun in order to change the sentence to express a negative meaning. Some is replaced by the pronoun none. Affirmative meaning, some of the visitors arrived late. Negative meaning, none of the visitors arrived late. Similarly, if it is desired to change a clause beginning with somebody, someone, something or somewhere, so that it expresses a negative meaning, these words may be replaced by nobody, no one, nothing and nowhere, respectively. Example, affirmative meaning, someone left a message, negative meaning, no one left a message. Affirmative meaning, something has happened, negative meaning, negative meaning is, nothing has happened. A sentence containing the word some in which some does not occur at the beginning of a clause can be changed to express a negative meaning by changing the sentence into a negative statement using not and by changing some to any. Let's see the example. Affirmative meaning. I bought some potatoes. Negative meaning. I did not buy any potatoes. Affirmative meaning. We will copy some of the recipes. Negative meaning, we will not copy any of the recipes. Uh, these are the uses of some and any. Please keep watching. I have also uploaded some other determiners. These are not only the determiners, there are other determiners as well. So I covered only the use of some and any uh, in this video. So have a great time. In case you have any problem or in understanding, you can pause the video and then you can also see uh, it is written clearly. And in case you have problem, please feel free to ask me. Have a great time. Bye bye.